and the princess. Good day everyone, it's Peachy, and welcome back to more Mario Party 7 Deluxe Edition. So, um, the basic concept of, um, 8 player ice battle is basically your Mario Party minigame list. Just the first to how many wins. I'm colder than a frozen kipper. Um, yeah. Oh, dang it. Oh well. Okay, so yeah, so you get how m you set how many victories. I'm only gonna do three, so this will be short. Um, the battle format you can have um, eight player battle, eight player team, or eight player combine. I usually do the team, so that's what we're gonna do. You can hack. You can actually have like one for all, so it's kind of like a eight, one versus one versus one, blah, 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 you know, until you get eight. But since me and Daisy are going to be working as a team, we're going to do this. Time to do this! So just three victories and it's yours. And I love the victory screen for this, so hopefully I, me and Daisy are the ones that get it. I always felt that um, this should have been a, what do you call it, records minigame. But I think... Maybe it's because, I don't know, how many of you do play with six computer players? Well, seven, too. You can't have seven. Because I usually do eight as well, or six computer players. I never, like, play just by myself and seven computer players. I always do teamwork. Because it's way more fun doing both the work rather than letting the computers do the work. It's the whole two versus two thing. So we're going to make more smoothies. Ha, ah, oranges. I'll drink orange juice. I don't know, orange smoothie. I don't know if I would drink that. I should try one. Ah, oh, dang it. And then I like how the computer player's smoothie machine just shuts down after they lose. Dun, 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 dun. Look out, we have a team that only needs one more victory. Wow, this was kind of shorter than I thought it would be. Maybe I'll just tag it on to the next part. I mean, to the previous part. Because... That would be more effective, I think. Let's see. It took me almost 16 minutes to do that one, so this might... Yeah, it could be. I could just tag them both together. Oh, who got it? Warren Waluigi. I had it. I know I did, but I messed up. Oh well, it looks like this is gonna be a dull episode now. Uh, oh well, maybe that's for the best. Dun, 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 dun. I like how the pink ones are in the back too. The unhappy trails. I'm just curious. So for those of you who've played Mario Party 7, which two characters do you use a lot? Because obviously I use Peach and. Um, I want to say I use Daisy a lot, but there is one problem with that, so... Whoa, 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 oh! I still fell. I kind of prefer having Peach do the first portion. That way, you know, I get a good lead. But, um, this could be effective too, because... I don't know. I, but I always feel like the control stick person should be the first to go and then the C-stick the second and third. Okay, so far so good. Finish. 
Wow, I cannot believe how much changes there have been since Mario Party 1. Who would have guessed that when I was playing Mario Party 3 there would be Mario Party 7? But I had a feeling there was going to be a, a lot of sequels. And by this point in time, Mario Party 3DS, I'm still anticipating its arrival. So I'm very excited to play it too. And I'm kind of glad that they took the car thing out. The winner is... Ah oh yeah, check it out. We have a penguin sculpture with Aurora in the back. And shooting stars. No way! No way! Now, I think this video will be by itself. Alrighty then, that's it for Deluxe Crew, so... Yeah. Oh yeah, and yeah, Crew's mileage points, which is awesome. Alrighty then, so I guess... Uh, solo Crew's speaks for itself, basically, because... It's just like Party Crew's, but just... A one versus one. Nothing too fancy. This is where you unlock the bowser board so make sure you get playing or else you won't have the bowser board and you also unlock a very particular mini game which I have yet to play but all in good time peoples so anyways now we're finished with all the side stuff it's gonna be time to take on the finale of Mario Party 7 which is the last board being Bowser's Enchanted Inferno so that will take place next weekend same time same place no i'm kidding it will take place next week so i hope you will anticipate the way even longer as i'm getting ready to prepare for it it's gonna be very exciting i can tell but until next time bye